The last one is honor self, honor other. This is the relational part of authentic relating. If you heard my talk on Thanksgiving, I defined authentic self-expression. And authentic self-expression is when you find your truth and you're willing to share it. But the relating part of authentic relating is also considering what is in service of the other person that you are in dialogue with, that you are in relationship with. What are their needs? And, and not to ignore yours exclusively in service of theirs, but how to coexist, how to hold the polarity of your experience and opinions are just as valid as my experiences and opinions. And I'm gonna honor me, and I'm gonna honor you. One of the lessons I got to learn in my partnership um, with my new husband, Kevin, is that I'm pretty quick to process. If I have an experience, I kind of know what I want to say about it or what I feel about it. And something I've learned about Kevin is that he, I might need to circle back with him in a day to really get his truth, to really have, he's better digested what that experience was. And, and he's had some time to sit with it. And if I want you know, true, objective feedback about his experience, I will maybe wait a day circle back. Hey, how was that for you yesterday when we were doing that thing? You know, what was that like? And so that's me honoring other. But then honoring me because I get more of what I want, which is the truth. Real feedback loop. 